Do you want to use your keyboard of your computer to trigger your own sampled sounds? Well, this app is exactly for you. Hi, I'm Ewan and welcome to my channel. Now, 10 years ago, I was using an app which was really inspiring and my students absolutely loved it. And it allowed me to trigger samples using my computer keyboard. And that app was called Sound Plant. It's a really good environment to be able to then use and trigger your own sounds, especially if you're starting out or if you're a bit more seasoned and have your very own sounds that you want to be able to trigger, but don't have a music keyboard, you'll just have your computer keyboard instead. So Sound Plant is a really, really cool way where you can then change and trigger certain sounds. And we're we're gonna have a quick look at it today. So this is the interface of Sound Plant and you can see basically that you've got color keys that correspond to the keys of your keyboard as well. And every time you press one of these, it makes a sound happen. And at the moment what I've got is I've got different sounds associated with different keys and every time I press those, then those sounds are triggered. So we're gonna have a very brief look at the interface of this. And if you want to download this app, I'm gonna leave links in the description down below of this video as well. At the bottom, you've got various controls. You've got volume, you've got pan, you've got pitch shift, and you've got different filters that you can play around with that sound. Let's see if we can manipulate that here. Let's change the volume of the sound. Fairly straightforward. So let's have a look at the pan, so left and right. And let's have a look at the speed. You can change the speed. And then also you can change how it's processed. And you can do very similar with the filters on the right hand side, so the low, the mid and the high. So if you wanted to take it the high pass, and if you want to take it the low, you can do that just with a mouse, it's fairly straightforward. Now what's really cool about this app is the fact that you can basically record anything from your keyboards. It's a really good way to get rhythm and music ideas down quickly after we press record. And then we press stop and then what it asks you to do is then save that what you can then do is you can then load up your audio sound from the desktop and or wherever you saved it and then you can import it into your digital audio workstation if you wanted to do further editing with that or you can even just edit it just plainly within uh, QuickTime for example or any other audio editor that you may have. This app as I say is free although you can also pay for a full license. Of course this channel is all about making your music masterpiece so if you want to be part of our channel then please hit subscribe as well as like this video and hit the bell notification so that you get notified every time I go live on my live streams but also upload a new video as well. I hope you found this really interesting. I hope you found this a bit different as well and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thanks very much for watching. Bye for now.